Well, this is gonna be a little intro video to my channel. First video, and I might as well give you a little tour and tell you about myself. Um, 26. I'm a design engineer. I have my civil engineering degree from Michigan Tech. Go Huskies. And I realize my friends kind of are impressed by all the things I do, things I work on, um, things I'm into, constantly educating myself. So I figured I might as well share a couple things I work on and things I do. And uh, right now I'm just in the little front room, right out that way to my garage. Um, let's give you a little tour first. First, I got a little kegerator here. I do home brew. I will show you. I've got my uh, first batch and my first um, from on my all electric system. Getting ready to serve. Here's my kitchen. Nothing really special. Um, walking through the living room. And right in this front room is where I brew. And let's see if I can get pull this out a little bit. So I got found the sink on Craigslist, deal of the deal, 320 bucks with everything. Just had to plumb it in, so it wasn't too bad. I got all my tubing. Shout out to Bargain Fittings for all my connections. And here I got I have a counterflow chiller. Got three kegs that I cut open. Got my heating elements, false bottom still up there. Um, and then this guy. That took a little while to build. But since I got everything all wired in, I've made only three batches of beer with this. It's definitely taking a little bit of effort. But it's definitely worth it. You have precise control. Uh, up your mash or boil, everything's electric. Unplug it, that huge sink is great for cleaning everything. Now, let's go up to the fun area. By the way, I live in kind of middle of nowhere. Um, I've only paid $8,000 for this house, and it's more than I ever need. This is just a garage. I bought this house from ran a body shop out of here and right now about to go in my shop the pole barn uh, I've got a 27 foot Thompson and this guy at work going through a divorce and his boat needed to be fixed so he's stored here for the winter um, as we're walking over here yeah this is a my uncle's boat that Bought it, he bought it not running and it wouldn't go into gear, so I fixed that for him. Only it's like $20 to seal, so I had to buy. Got the heat going because I got a little bit of work to do on my 93 F 150. I rebuilt the engine on it this winter and I only took time lapses and stuff like that. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Um, Trying this light over here. Got my air compressor. And. This is the paint booth. It's got an exhaust fan and air filters on the other side of the door so you can just drive right in here. There's two garage doors, as you can tell. Um, right now in here, I don't know if you can kind of see this a little dark, but there's a 92 and a 94 Boston Whaler jet boat, uh, Boston Whaler Rages. One's got a 45 horse, one's got a 90 horse. Um, pick those up. Gonna sell those soon to fix them up this winter. Uh, just test ran this bad boy the other day. She's about to go get ready to put insurance on her so I can have her as a nice spare vehicle. My regular daily driver is a 2002 Jeep Wrangler. Keep her pretty much stock, but I've done pretty much everything to that. Um, got a 1985 Honda Shadow, 700 cc. Um, this guy left the lawnmower here. 
I don't know, it's a John Deere, I think it's from the 70s or 80s, probably the 80s. Uh, weight bench, weed whacker, chalk paint, to-do list, highly recommend it. Uh, I mountain bike a lot, uh, road bike, I got my bikes up there, I got one more bike on the trainer. Wood uh, stove, don't really use that too much. Uh, engine oil. That's pretty much my property. Things I do, things I work on. Uh, I didn't really point out things in the kitchen, but uh, posters and stuff like that. But I've been really getting into stock trading lately. It's always a lot of fun. It's a great way to, for your money to make money. But right now I gotta get working on getting this uh, master cylinder fixed. It blew out on the clutch, so get that going and thanks for watching my channel hopefully stick with it